Tech Pimp News update. All right, so today we have the Snapdragon 835, and Qualcomm teamed up with Samsung to make this chip. That's why they were able to bring it down to a 10 nanometer technology, and it brings 30% increased efficiency with significant battery increases, like so enhancement. So pretty much you're gonna get more battery out of this, and it's also gonna be available next year, probably around mid 2017, because the manufacturers will get it around uh, early 2017. It also supports Quick Charge 4.0. So what is QuickTime 4.0? Well, it's 20% faster than 3.0, has 30% more efficiency, and the best part is it's gonna be 5% cooler, okay? And in, in five minutes, they're saying you should get five hours of charge. All right, also in 15 minutes, they're claiming you're gonna get 50% charge, and it supports dual charge. What that means is let's say that you have this battery that's QuickTime 4.0, and then you wanna like, charge it at the same time you're charging your phone so what it does is it splits the charge and you're gonna get about half the charge speed what QuickTime 4.0 really is is you're gonna get a burst all the way up to 50 percent so you're gonna get all five volts and if it does get hot for some reason it's gonna throttle the CPU to bring it down so it doesn't get hot and always keep it nice and cool for the first five minutes you're talking about it's gonna give you like 35 to 40 percent and then 50% you're gonna get in 15 minutes. And then as it keeps getting closer to the end, that extra 50% should take maybe about an hour. It's expected to come around the same time as the Snapdragon 835. So we should see it as soon as the Snapdragon phones come out with the 835. So look out for it. In other news, Allo brought some great new updates. So if you're using it, you're definitely gonna enjoy the new updates. I'm not gonna get into it because we're still using Allo. I couldn't get all my contacts on there, I'm sorry. It's a great app, but it's just not there anymore. Please watch my video on why I deleted Allo and moved on to Google Messenger. Okay guys, so that's all for me. I hope you liked it. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon.